Good morning guys and girls, today I will show you how to do your first pull up from 0 to 1, stay tuned! Coach Marco aka Calimarco PT and today it's my pleasure to show you how to progress from 0 pull up to your first pull up. No doubt about it, pull up is the best compound exercise for your back. Any kind of training, crossfit, powerlifting, weighting, just bodybuilding and of course calisthenic, pull up it's a must. But it's also the most difficult, especially if you are a beginner. So the first requirement you need to be patient. This will take times. There is no point to go to, to just approach a bar and try to hit your first pull up if you don't have enough strength. Try to do something like that, like this, things like that with a with a no correct form, just cheating, just jumping or bending your knees, half range motion, etc. Strength, you need to be strong, enough strong to pull your, your chest up to the bar. And second, mobility. You have to be able to, to have a full range motion of your shoulder. If you lift your shoulder, you arrive here. Don't even start to do pull up. It can be also a little bit dangerous. You can get injured. At least your shoulder at the same level you're here and much better behind your here. So work also for your shoulder mobility at the beginning. In order to improve your shoulder mobility, you can watch my videos. I to stretch and reinforce your shoulder, especially your rotator cuff. So let's start. First of all, there are two kinds of pull up. The first one like this, they are called a chin up. And this one, they are just call it proper. They are just proper call it pull up, chest to the bar. Between the two, chin up are more easy. That's why it's good to start with chin up. When you will master chin up, you can start to work on your pull ups. Let's assume you have enough mobility on your shoulder. They start to work for your strength. The first exercise they are really recommend to everybody is just hold isometric chin ups. So you go up and you stay in this position as much as you can. At the beginning, you can start with 10 seconds, then you progress to 15, 20, 30 seconds. Your goal is to reach four sets of one minute. This is a really important step to conditioning your forearm because you hold the position, we need to reinforce our wrist and most important, our forearm, enough strength to hold our body up to the bar. After you can close quite easy four sets of one minute of chin up hold, Let's revert and let's start to work of your pull-up hold position. Also in this case, start easy 15-20 seconds. Let's move on until you can reach easily one minute. Second exercise, second movement that, that you have to master is just the negative chin-up and negative pull-ups. Let's start again with chin-up. We will use our legs to jump up to the bar. So you bend your knees, chin-up position. You jump to the bar and slowly you go down. From here, reset, jump again, up, slowly, go down. Don't bend your knee, contract your gluteus, posterior pelvis tilt, three, two, one, jump, and slowly down. Okay, after that you master this, you will do the properly pull up, always pull up negative. So from this position, always jump with your leg, bar to the chest, Slow it down, slow it down, slow it down. Touch and we repeat. Three, two, one, jump up. Hold a little second, rest pause. And you go slowly down. After you master the chin up negative and then pull up negative, we can finally start to approach the Australian chin up and of course the Australian pull up. You just need a low bar. Remember to stay fully straight with your body. Always contract your gluteus and engage your core. So from here, chin up, Australian, explosive up, slowly down. You can do sets starting from five, six, eight repetition. When this will be comfortable, let's progress to Australian pull-ups. So just we revert the grip, fully extended, chest to the bar, slowly down, grip out, grip in. In this way, for sure, you will get your first pull-up. Now I want to give you a little present to all of you. I will give you a full workout program. 
Let's start with the workout. The first thing that you have to reach in up strength of your forearm, just hanging. If you are not able to hang yourself for at least one minute, you cannot progress. So your first goal, hit the bar, posterior pervitil, breathe, empty your mind until you can stay in this position for at least one minute and work to close four sets of one minute. Second exercise, just 30 seconds of isometric chin-up hold. So you stay here. Until 30 seconds. Third exercise, always 30 seconds of isometric pull-up hold. Exercise number four, just negative chin-up. So you jump slowly down try to eat at least eight repetition exercise number five negative pull up you jump chest to the bar slowly down and you jump again slowly down let's move on after this we have the australian chin up Always eight repetition for set of eight repetition, and after that, Australian pull up. Always aim for eight repetition. So let's resume. We want to do four set of isometric hanging. If you are quite good, you can start with 60 seconds, one minute. Then we progress to isometric hold the chin up position. Always we want to eat 60 seconds. Then we do isometric hold pull up position. After this, we start to work on negative chin up. We want to eat eight slash 10 repetition. Then we move on to isometric hold pull up. Always four set of eight, 10 repetition. Then we start with the Australian chin up with four set of eight slash 10 repetition. And the last one, Australian pull-up with four set of eight, 10 repetition. Of course, this is an example of a very good workout that I tried with so many clients. So for sure you will get results, but you have to adapt to your circumstance. So if you cannot close four set of 60 seconds of, for example, isometric hold, just start with four set of 30 seconds or maybe four set of 20 seconds. After this, last around one week and try to hit your first pull up and for sure you can do one pull up or even more. Thanks for watching my video. Let me know in the comment below if you have any questions. It will be my pleasure to answer to all of you. Smash the like button. Remember also to subscribe my channel and follow me on Instagram. Remember, stay strong, stay healthy, stay fit, stay connected with Calimarco PT.